Today, thousands of people kicked off uh, the week-long nationwide rally for immigration reform. It is called the Keeping Families Together Tour, and NBC4's Lolita Lopez was right in the thick of it. I feel like this is my country, too. So I came here when I was three, so I don't have any memory of Korea. This is my home. They are the stories of both young and old. I want to keep my family together. Stories of SoCal's undocumented immigrants speaking out to ensure they and their loved ones stay in the country. Do you feel like you're American? Yes, of course. Maria Galvan, her husband and two daughters came to the U.S. from Mexico 13 years ago. She says they work hard, pay taxes, but feel incomplete. We cut our careers and we can work here legally. So that's why we need a migration report. The immigration system! The call for reform is now headed on the road. Local groups have come together for the Keeping Our Families Together bus tour. First stop, Senator Dianne Feinstein's offices on the west side. We want a pathway to legalization for the 11 million undocumented people that are currently living in the shadows here in the United States. Unless that it's part of the deal, then we're not ready to stop fighting. Raise your heart. Members of Congress and President Obama have recently proposed or made changes to immigration policies, including allowing family members applying for visas to stay in the country during the process and deferred action for childhood arrivals, which gives qualifying young adults legal status for two years. But it is not enough. We need a permanent solution. This tour will last three days and go through cities in Southern and Northern California with one final stop for some of these people, Washington, D.C. Senator Feinstein is working on new legislation and says in a statement, a pathway to citizenship is a critical component of any immigration reform proposal. Lolita Lopez, NBC4 News.